Wow! The pink spirit moth! If you love lunar moths or moon moths, get ready to find out that there is a pink variety of them in Asia. This rare species is called the pink spirit moth. Or Arctias rhodopneuma. They fly on high altitude in the mountains in East Asia. This species is incredibly rare and very few people have ever seen it in real life. And this channel is the only channel on the internet so far that has live footage of this super rare moon moth. Amazing! Number 2! With this one you will be impressed. Meet the Caleta silk moth. This is Eupacaria caleta and these moths are found in Arizona, New Mexico, Texas, Mexico, Honduras and Guatemala. Whoa, isn't this the biggest, blackest one that you have ever seen? Please don't answer that, that's a rhetorical question. This species has inspired many people to study moths. The African moon moth, Archema mimosa, is one incredible and awesome species of moth from tropical Africa. It is bright yellow with tails on its hind wings. I think we can all agree that moon moths are some of the most beautiful species out there. These moths really tickle my pickle, they are so impressive. Okay, who is coming up with this script? Oh wait, it's me. Quickly moving on. I am very proud of having filmed this rare silk moth species. Yes people, I film all the moths on this channel myself. Unlike some other moth related channels on YouTube, who just steal images from Google and lazily add their own voiceover to it, reading information they found on Wikipedia. You know exactly who you are. It is sloppy content. Anyway, this is Rinaka Lindia, a species of silk moth from the Himalayas. It has gorgeous red eye spots to blow you away. This is one of the smallest species of hog moths on planet Earth. It is Sphingona piopsis sculia densis from Kazakhstan, China, Uzbekistan, Kazakhstan, Afghanistan and Mongolia. A super small and rare species of hog moth is proof that size does not matter. Or at least that's what we all tell ourselves, but who are we really trying to convince here? Alright now this one is insane, look at those bright false red eyes and it's completely and utterly hypnotic. Whoa, it's trying to brainwash me into thinking the Democrats have stolen the election. Jokes on them because they actually need to have a brain in order for brainwashing to be effective. But hey, it's expected that narcissists can't accept the fact they lost. This amazing creature is found in Southeast Brazil and Argentina and in the house of Bart Coppen sometimes too. Oops guys, I just realized I made fun of the Republicans, but you know what, in order to compensate for that I also want to make a joke about the Democrats. But then I realized something, they are way too sensitive to take a joke. Plus YouTube would probably censor or ban me since social media is on their side. Anyway, this is Smerintus planus, an amazing species of hot moth from Asia with extremely gorgeous eye spots. It is mind blowing and super beautiful and deserves to be included in this top 20. Number 8 The Chinese Moon Moth, Actias di Bernardi, an actually rare and difficult to breed species. These moths are from China, Laos, Vietnam and perhaps also Cambodia and any place in this region with mountains, high altitude, temperate cloud forest with pine trees. Talk about picky. They are so 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 pretty and honestly it's one of the prettiest moth species in the world. Wow, another amazing giant silk moth species stealing the show. It's called the Fiery Devil Moth. Citeronia Bella Vista, it is found in Colombia, Honduras, Nicaragua, Costa Rica, Panama, Western Venezuela, Western Ecuador, and also South Ecuador. And its color pattern is amazing. Just look at how awesome this species is. Oh my gosh, a truly fantastic species of insect. If only it was possible to have designs like these on clothing or other items. How fancy that would be. 
It is possible! The good news is, you see, I design merchandise myself using my own pictures and videos of moths. I have over 50,000 butterfly and moth photographs because I am obsessed. And I process them into mouse mats, mugs, stickers, posters, t-shirts, water bottles and more. Check out my red bubble. Part of the revenue or sales goes back to me and helps me sustain this demonetized insect channel. Next one! Oh my god, it is amazingly large. Yeah, right, that's what she said. This is one of the largest species of moth in the world. It's also known as Lorcan's Atlas Moth or Atacus Lorcini. One thing people don't realize is that there are many species of Atlas Moth around the world. This one right here, for example, is endemic to the Philippines. And on top of that, it is huge. I love this species and I breed a lot of them. Sometimes I end up with too many of them in fact. Oops, have you ever been surrounded by giant atlas moths? Well I have. It certainly is an experience, I can tell ya. These moths have no mouth and cannot eat and despite their huge size their lifespan is limited to just two weeks. Emurena luroides is the name of this silly beast right here. It is endemic to Southeast Brazil only. Yes, only! Nowhere else in the world. So I'm lucky to have filmed it, babes. Tiger moths in most cases are poisonous and they advertise this fact with bright colors. This can make them very pretty and attractive in some cases. What a beauty. I bet you've never seen this one. Wow, this creature mimics a species of parasitic wasps. Some wasps have very long ovipositor as you can see and this moth even has the fake ovipositor on its abdomen to convince its predators that it is indeed a wasp. This moth right here is Trigura cerebus. It is found in Trinidad and the Brazilian states of Sao Paulo and Rio de Janeiro. An amazing and incredible find. And not something you would see on someone else's channel, so I am glad that you are here. This is Amata Mojadorensis, the North African wasp moth. It is found in Morocco and Algeria. This incredibly stunning moth is metallic blue and black with bright stripes on its abdomen. What a fantastic and beautiful insect, don't you think? This moth is rare, it was hard to obtain cocoons of them and to make a video. Yes people, I film all the moths on this channel uh, myself. Every sea insect that you see on this channel, every moth, every butterfly, I went and filmed them myself. That's right, this crazy silk moth right here is found in Mexico, Guatemala, El Salvador and Honduras and it is a species of Leucanella contempta bindi. Wow. What a beautiful animal. Insects are so important for the environment, yet they get so little attention. My channel hopes to change this fact. Wow! This is the giant comet moth, also known as Archema mitriae. It is one enormous species that is found in Madagascar. This huge, incredible and large species surely leaves a lasting impression on anyone that has ever seen them in real life. What a splendid and spectacular species of insect. Utterly impressive and amazing. It has such long tails too, especially the males. The environment of Madagascar and its native animals and wildlife deserve to receive more respect and conservation. Look at this giant creature. Despite being traded in the pet trade sometimes, these insects are very difficult to breed. I'd like to film their life cycle sometime. Whee! Saturnia pavoniella, the Mediterranean emperor moth. The males are orange while their females are white. This super impressive and incredible moth is found in Central Europe and can only be seen in spring for it has just one generation a year. And they have some incredible eye spots too and fuzzy hair that makes them soft. While they only live a few days, these moths live long enough just to mate, lay eggs and die like a lot of other species. It is the circle of life. Ma Simba, when the lions die, we turn into grass, and the zebras eat the grass, and we eat the zebras. All life is interconnected and balanced. 
Now let me proceed to rule over all the other animals because I believe lions are racially superior. I mean the movie did get something right, the fact that most leaders are in fact predators. What? Why is a wasp in this top 20? Aha, you got tricked. Or let's pretend you got tricked for the suspension of disbelief and to keep some surprise in here. This is Pseudosex rubi palpus and it perfectly mimics the wasp species Sinuica cinea. If you paid some attention, you would have noticed this top 20 contains several species of wasp mimicking moths because I am fascinated by them. But this one is perhaps the most convincing one on the list. It appears to be endemic to Southeast Brazil. If you are wondering why so many species from Southeast Brazil are on this top 20 list, it's simply because I recently visited it. So I have a lot of footage of the butterflies and moths from there, from the Brazilian rainforest that I can use. And look at how amazing the mimicry is, however, it even mimics the red jaws of the species of wasp that it's pretending to be. Whoa, oh, the detail is just amazing. This one is crazy beautiful. It is known as the dragon sphinx, or Hemeroplanus longistriga. This species appears to have a restricted range from Brazil to northern Argentina. It has been recorded in the south, southeast and northeast regions of Brazil. It appears to favor higher altitudes. And honestly, it's probably one of my favorite species of sphinx moths. Look at this amazing beauty. Maybe one day we will we'll be able to breed this species in captivity. Wouldn't that be amazing, don't you think? Let's hope we can pull it off. Wow! Phegoptera de Picta is perhaps one of the most gorgeous moths that I have ever seen in my life. Yeah, this top 20 has a lot of tiger moths. I'm crazy about them. The colors and patterns on this one are simply amazing. Look at the white and gold here. And once again, once again, yes, once again, this species is endemic to Southeast Brazil. God, people, please visit Southeast Brazil to find moths like these. On my channel, you can even find guides on how to attract and study these moths. In all seriousness, in these videos, I often act silly and say silly things to entertain people. But despite my ridiculous behavior and clowning, this channel is dedicated to butterflies and moths. I want to show people how diverse, how complex and how beautiful they are. And I hope you subscribe so that you can learn more about these animals on my channel. Madagascar Bullseye Moth, Anterina Suraka. Honestly, look at those crazy eye spots. Isn't this beauty out of this world? There are so many species of moths on our beautiful planet. I am so sad we are treating the planet so poorly. Did you know moths have declined 30% to 50% in most countries? If we don't change the way we are ruining the environment, we may end up losing a lot of these animals. Most people don't think about moths, but they are very important food for birds, for bats, and many species are pollinators of plants and flowers. So do please subscribe to my channel to learn more about moths. This species right here is only found in Madagascar and nowhere else. Thank you for watching guys, I hope you guys really like this top 20. I promise soon I will be back with more compilations of amazing and mind-blowing species of moths. I know you all love my compilations, insects are declining and the only thing that helps against this is education. We have to show the world how great, amazing, admirable and important moths really are. And this channel hopes to make the difference. Thanks so much for watching, I appreciate you being here with me today. Bye bye babes, catch you in the next one.